So I um, watched the full solo trailer twice. Once this morning and then once just now. And oh, what can I say? He's horrible. That is not Han Solo. I don't get Han Solo from Alden Ehrenreich. Um, who cast him? Why was he cast? Was he the best they could do ever? The thousands of people they said they auditioned and talked to? No, he wasn't. I, I'm trying to, I mean, the one scene where they show him asking Chewbacca if he was in, whatever that means, his hair. I mean, did you get Han from that at all? Or the part where he says, I'm going to be the best pilot in the galaxy. Han would never say that. He never had to. Well, see, here's the deal that, <laughs> again, Disney's writers don't understand cool, what cool means. Someone is, who is cool never has to tell you they're cool, okay? Uh, you know, Han never said to Luke or anybody else, I'm the best pilot in the galaxy. He said the ship was the fastest ship. Was a fast, no, he said the ship was a fast ship. She made the Kessel Run in less than 12 parsecs. But he never said, I am the best pilot in the galaxy. Was he cocky? Yeah. But he never said how good he was, but we've got him saying. And and then like, well, it's a new take and he, this is the young Han Solo. No, you don't understand. That's not what I'm saying. Guys like Han are born. All right, they're just born. They're born cool. The confidence, the, the overarching confidence of the character is what makes him cool, all right? This is a, this is a gunfighter, the quintessential gunfighter. Um, you know, it's all show, not tell with guys like that. The essence of cool, and it's like, Aaron Reich telling somebody he's gonna be the best pilot in the galaxy, some re military recruiter. Oh, and then, of course, I'm going to bring it up again. How much did they steal from the EU? They hated, but they still took the military academy, the TIE fighter pilot thing. You know, I mean, Disney is about as original as a green toenail fungus. I mean, you know, and I'm just, I, the worst thing about it, though, is casting Aaron Reich. This movie's going to flop, Okay. You know, I saw enough of him to make me say that's not Han. Um, I mean, I think maybe he could have played a young Luke Skywalker. You know? But, see, here's the deal about Han Solo. He's not just a character. He has a mystique. He is a presence. Harrison Ford has all of that. That charisma. The height. That m manly man thing. And I'm watching Aaron Wright going, no, no, go home. Go back to your mom's basement, kid. Seriously. You know, it's just, this is appalling. It's, this, this, this movie is appalling to me. You know, I mean, I mean, Donald Glover actually is passable. Um, you know, and, and the movie would probably have been decent if they would have cast somebody else's hair as Han Solo. All right. I'm going to give you guys um, a little mission to go on. Go look up a guy named Anthony Ingruber. I will put a picture of him at the end of this. And I will put his name on there so you know how to spell it. Find him on YouTube. Go watch the movie The Age of Adeline. And you tell me, you know, and somebody said, well, he was, he, they, they auditioned him. They did not audition him. As far as I know, they never called him. Why? I don't know. I know they auditioned one of the Franco brothers. I think it was, I'm going to say it was Dave because he's the younger one. But there, no, that was, I was just like, no, he can't, no, 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 no. 
you know, wimpy, wimpy, wimpy does not hear Han Solo make. But we got wimpy, wimpy, wimpy now. This is, this is atrocious. This is another big F you to us, the fans. They think they're doing fan service, and they're not. They're just saying, here's a Han Solo movie that no one asked for. All right, leave it alone. You know, this is another, this is another reason why, you know, Disney's is probably going to lose its licensing, or Hasbro's not going to re-up its licensing with, with that Disney. Um, they can't sell toys because they make movies like this. This is shit. All right. I mean, it's, it's creating a character isn't just creating a character on a page and having someone read it. You have to get the right actor to do it. All right. Isn't that true? Okay. If you if it takes a th twenty thousand auditions, then go do twenty thousand auditions. Okay. Because this is Han Solo. This is not just a mother character. And I'm not just saying that. And oh, you're old. Well, fuck you. You know, I'm fifty. That is not old. Okay. You know, to to you whiny, you know, you know disrespectful little millennials who don't know anything, who are ignorant of everything, and think you know everything. Shut up. Just go sit down. Okay, I have no time. I, this is why I tolerate no trolls, all right? I just don't. I don't want to hear about it. If you can't logically come up with a reason to have your opinion, it's all about how you feel about something, and I can tell pretty much if it's about if if you feel if your opinion is based on feeling rather than rationality, information, facts, and logic. I'm probably just gonna dismiss you out of hand. All right, I don't do the feels. All right, that's what life does to you. Okay, so we're gonna come on here and defend Aaron Reich fine, but you better have a good reason, and you better have facts, and it better not be fanboy shit either. Okay. Because I will probably delete the comment. I don't want to hear it. All right? I'm, you know, we're sick and tired of this. People, the real Star Wars fans are sick and tired of this shit. And, you know, The Last Jedi I thought was the last straw, and I thought those, they couldn't get any lower. Then I see Alden Ehrenreich as Han. He's too short. I don't know what that haircut is. And last night in the teaser, he looked like a ginger. Um, his voice is... Uh, he, he's just not Han Solo. That was not Han Solo, okay? Um, and that's what I got out of the trailer. I mean, you know, it, you know, and, and I'm going to tell you something else. The rumors that he did a bad job and he couldn't do, he couldn't, he, he was, he needed a coach are probably true because he is awful, even in the trailer. He is awful. Okay, so this is Steph. Not happy, signing out, and I'm gonna leave you a picture of Anthony and Gruber. Talk at you all later. Also, um, just one more thing. I want you all to know that Harrison Ford himself was behind Anthony and Gruber. All right, he likes him. They've been in movies before together. They know each other. Uh, and Gruber would have been a fantastic Han Solo. Okay. You know, if Han Solo himself says that guy would do do a good job playing me. As a young man, as a kid, hey, okay, that's all I need. <laughs> Good job, Kath Kathleen Kennedy. Good job, all right? You not only, you know, f fuck up hiring directors, you fucked up casting probably the most beloved character in Star Wars as a young man. You are unbelievable. <sighs> See you around the galaxy.